This is Lola Lee T. Hey everyone, how are you guys doing? Welcome to my channel. So Blueface was on Instagram live with Jason Lee explaining more in detail of why he came to snatch his son. What were the circumstances of why he snatched Junior? And that is in the middle of this video that I'm posting here. Also in this IG Live, he tells us that when he came home last night, Jaden Alexis was gone. Jaden has left him. Jaden has left him. I'm actually really happy that she left him. Jaden Alexis, I am so proud of you. Blueface couldn't answer if they were still engaged, but he was talking to people on live because he was looking for new talent. He also gave a tour of the house and it is still trashed. And I'm so happy that Jaden Alexis didn't clean that place up. If he wants to clean the place up, maybe he should hire a maid. How about that? Listen to this. Mad fighting girls is weak as fuck. Hey, weak as fuck. I hit back. Weak. Hey, okay, that's what it is. Uh, I don't know. Let me see. Let me see your image. Let me see. Let me see how we're looking. What you <laughs> like? Move your hand. <laughs> okay. Okay. Got, got all your teeth. And look. Okay. Look. Yeah. We can work. I mean. See, my ex punched me in my head. Everybody should keep saying, be honest. They keep saying what you just said. Don't. They keep saying, I can't be honest, read like, the comments. You're right. You're right. But I don't think none of y'all are the problem. Y'all just, it's put right, aside. Everybody did with that type of shit, right? Right. All right. You got a baby daddy? No, I don't have kids. Good. That's good. That's good. Oh, hey, what's happening? <laughs> He's so cute. That's what we like. Sorry. Right. We want to see the real you. Okay, let me put some pants on real quick. What the hell? How are you going to come on Instagram Live and have no pants on? But she does have pants on. Everybody's going to show me their booty today. I'm, I'm no, 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 no. Don't take it back now, okay? Don't take it. Don't do that. Don't be ashamed. Ah. Uh. I like that though. I keep telling all these females, "Hey, let me let me let me see you," and they get to the turn around. All right, shit, fuck it. I guess it's going like that. Yeah. Shit, I ain't mad at it. What's the deal, though? Oh, where are you from? I'm from Vegas, the most hated place of you right now. Okay, and who's the problem? Who's the problem? Yep. I I'm gonna be honest. That shit is not that messy. We all be going through shit like that. Yeah, but. Who's the problem? You know who the problem is? Me? That liquor. That drink? Yep. Yeah. yeah. Drunk I bitches are... About next. Huh? They all talking about next. Boo, suck my dick. All right, tell them. Don't read the comments. I look down for one second. Yeah, no, don't look down. Look up. I'm looking up. Look up to me, Kat. I will. Don't start. I am your leader to no, fuck with you. <laughs> you want to join the circus or what? I will. Don't play with me. I'm funny too. Funny? Tell me, I make am. me laugh. Make you laugh? Yep. Oh shit, Blue, you gonna kick me off? Cause I'm not that good at jokes. <laughs> what do you mean? So you just, you just on here? Oh, shut up. She was cool, but he wasn't really certain. I need certainty. Bro, here you go, Carlissa. Man, that's a, that's a good topic. You know, that, oh, fuck, that's one I'm forgetting. Car, you know what the problem is? Carlissa is the goddamn problem. That's the problem. Carlissa. Carlissa, she the problem. Out of this whole feng shui, Carlissa is the problem, for sure. 100%. What do you think? I'm about to start asking people if Carlissa the problem. I'm gonna blame Carlissa. Is. Hey, mama always told me I was gonna break hearts. It's I guess it's her fault. Don't be mad at me, baby. You baby. She told me this. She the problem because she told me I was she ever since I was born. She like son, you gonna break all these women's hearts. So 
was her fault. DDG in here? Where DDG at? DDG ain't in here. Blue face. That does not tell us why you think she is the problem. We need details. Give us details. Why is your mom the problem? Explain. I need to figure out how to add a motherfucker. Hold on. View request. Someone join the new one. Let me see that. Fuck. How the fuck? If DDG in here, tell her to, uh, to slide up. Didi, where you at, bro? Tap in. Welcome to Blue's World. No, Carlos is the problem for sure. That's my new answer. Carlos is the problem. Everybody go spam Carlos right now and say, You are the problem. How the hell? Okay. Hello? Scary ass. This is all entertainment, guys. This is all entertainment. I want me to talk. Which I want me to talk about, okay? You know what? Tell, ask me a question on this motherfucker, and I'm gonna tell y'all what, what really, you know, what's really going on. Whoever got the best question, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna answer it like no bullshit. So this is the part where he tells us that Jaden is gone. And I really think that he's spiraling. And again, I'm so proud of Jaden Alexis for leaving. Hopefully she's realizing her worth. Where's Jaden? Jaden's gone. She left me. This is what it is. I came home last night and she was gone in the wind. Jason, is that you or is that your people that run Hollywood Unlocked? You always blaming when you fuck me over. I think it's you, Jason. Fucking liar. It's funny, every time Jason do some weird shit to me, he blame his team. Knowing damn well he running that goddamn page. His little some messy motherfucker. Yeah, let me try to add you, brother. Let me see. Block, add, add as moderator, go live with. All right, come on. Um. All right, so this is a part where he talks to Jason Lee. And I'm actually happy that Jason Lee got on here because now he can ask the questions that we all wanted to know. Listen to this. I cannot believe I'm getting attacked. Oh, you was a lying gay motherfucker. What I do? I thought you didn't run this page. Well, I'm logged in because you're live talking to lot thousands of people. Mm -hmm. I keep so, getting attacked. So when they when they post all that weirdo shit, you don't got nothing to do with it, huh? I don't even be at work, bro. I be I be on a plane. Man. Okay, but let, all right. Let so now that we got all the viewers here, let let let's really talk. Well, we talked about it on the Breakfast Club today, but nah, we didn't really nah, get nah, too nah, much nah, into nah. it. Uh -uh, what? What happened? What's so, going on? You said come ask I, questions. I can't even interview why, you. Why was I mad at you um, about the Rock interview? Was I mad because you interviewed Rock? Or was I no. mad because... Hey, 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 hey. You, t no, you, not, you, told me, you told me you had no issue with me interviewing anybody, including Carlissa. Right. But what you, why, what why you was say, I mad you, at you, though? What you, what you said was be fair. Thank you, because you wasn't fair. You And my team, my team her. was no, not no, fair. Don't do the, no, don't do the team thing, because she already told me that you showed her to trigger her and get, and get her riled up. What you just said on here that they, everybody's been lying all day, but now they, they tell the truth when they talk about me? I, I'm, I'm asking you, clear the air. So did you show her the, the clip where I said me and so-and-so? Listen, and listen. I'm at an age where or I don't did even your work. team, wait, did, she, did, she, did you show her or did your team show her? I want you to lock in the answer right now so everybody can see. My, te my team showed her. Listen, 
My, your team showed her my interview before you interviewed No, her. no, no, no. They didn't see your interview. I saw a clip, the same promo that went out. The same thing you went over there until Adam 22 was the same thing that she saw. Okay, so everyone in the chat, listen, I was mad at Jason. You, because, you weren't mad. You weren't mad. Uh, I was mad because when I asked you, hey, can I see the clips before you post it? What you tell me? No. This nigga gonna tell me, no, I don't do that over here. Well, actually, since we're telling the truth, actually, actually, no, no, that ain't ain't what you asked. That ain't what you asked. What you asked was, can you review and approve the interview first? No, I said, can I review the interview? Can I see it before it goes out? That's what I'm sure anybody will ask you that. And what did you say? Nobody's ever asked them. I said no. Okay, but so how the hell is Rock watching my interview before you even? She didn't. She did not watch. She didn't watch your interview. She watched the clip. How? My team. Why, I why, but wait, wait, wait. Why is, why is my clip up? Why is she coming to do her okay, interview? Okay, li- listen. Because Be a because message, that, Jason. Well, no, hold, message. On, hold on, hold on, hold on. Because that was a big interview. You dropped the bomb. I mean, what was I supposed to say? You know? So you, so you, you did tell her. No. You're... you're, you're All you're, right, whatever, a, bro. Whatever. You just... We're, a, we're, just we're a fucking, yeah, you just... You know what? how to play this game better than me. What you want to... No, what you no you're answer? better than me. Okay, I have questions. Okay. What's the question, bro? Okay, so... Uh, first of all, how you doing? You good? Yeah, I'm great. I'm uh, shit. You know, this shit for me, payment for me is, I don't really, okay. I wake up every day like nothing happened yesterday, too. Okay, but yesterday when the whole thing went down with you going over to the house to get the baby, how did you find out that the baby was by himself? I miss all the lives, so I apologize. All right, this. so basically, I just knew, I knew the baby was by himself. So I went over there and I go in the fucking room, Jason, and it's Marsh. Her son and two other kids and the baby all in the, on a blow up mattress on the floor. And I'm looking like, where's Krishan? She's like, oh, but, uh, 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 uh. where's Krishan? Oh, no, but, oh, yeah, okay. So I just grabbed the baby and I walked out. I didn't have no baby with Marsh. I don't even know why Marsh even did all of that. She could have simply let me leave. Krishan could have came and got the baby whenever she got done doing what she doing. And this shit would have been not even a thing. But you know what Krishan do? She called Marsh. Tell Marsh to fight me and stop me and don't let me take the baby. I'm looking like, yo, I have no relations to Marsh. I, I don't, you feel me? Like, I'm holding my son at this point, so Marsh is an enemy to me. Because why are you trying to take my son from me and you? Who the fuck are you? I don't, I didn't have no baby with you. <laughs> hey, what the fuck? Why am I happening? Like, you know, why is that happening between me and you? Where everybody's confused right now is you were just over there for the holidays and then. You're with Jaden, but then now they're together. Like, how, where did, did we miss something? Like, I'm confused as hell. What you What you mean? Did we miss something? So, like, how they end up now becoming a group? Yeah, see, that's where that's where shit went left. At. All right, fuck it. I'm gonna just tell you what happened. You wanna know what happened? Boom. I'm out. I'm like, fuck it. I'm finna. You feel me? Pull up. Pull up. Walk in. It's, uh, it's looking. It's, it's my, the baby's not looking like, you know, like, like a blue face baby. It's looking like, it's looking like, like just, you know, just like a regular kid with just everybody around. And I just wasn't feeling it. So I instantly pick up the child and I say, hey, I'm out of here. Just tell her, come get him. Whenever, whenever, whenever. I go to leave. Smart's jumping in the car with me, uh, following me, jumping in the Uber with me. That's when I posted. I'm like, bro, if you keep playing with me with this baby, like you finna fight me, turn around, hit me. I'm really gonna like, you know, I'm gonna have no choice but to. Protect the baby, you feel me? Because what, what are you going to do? Take the baby for me and run? Like, what? <laughs> Jason, do you realize I didn't have a baby with Marsh? Right. But was she so, babysitting the baby while she was at the studio, or was that just what she said? No, that's cat. <laughs> All of that is cat. Marsh is not babysitting nobody. Marsh is, what do you mean? <laughs> you feel me? Why, am I, why is my son in the bed with Marsh and other kids? Like, why, why he don't have a parent at four in the morning? It better be, you better be making a million fucking dollars. Right? How did you end up over there at four in the morning? What you mean, how I pulled up? Because you knew she was gone or, I mean, why? No, yes, I knew, I knew she was gone. So if she, if you gone, who's watching the baby? How you know she was gone though? What do you mean, how I know she's gone? What the fuck? You, you can find out what Rock is doing without even following the bitch, looking at her, nothing she does. <laughs> and so when the, when you got in the car with the girl and you told the girl, we're going to go over here and Jaden's going to be waiting 
Yeah, I'm telling it like you you about to run a fade with my, with, with Jaden now because at this point I'm not gonna beat you up. Like, and if you want to follow me all the way home with my son, like, what, how do you expect that to end? <laughs> all right. So when she got over there, was Jaden waiting? Because I remember when you guys were on the show, Jaden. Yeah, she was waiting. Run. She was waiting. She was waiting. All right. So this is how I got tricky. We, we got here and then March tried to like really fight me physically, like. When, when I told her in the car, like, yo, I'm finna, like, really hurt you. Because, like, you playing with me. I'm holding the baby. Like, you feel me? And she's playing with me. Like, I'm finna, like, you know, give me the baby. And I'm looking like, bitch, who the fuck are you? Like, at this point, I don't even see Marsh. Because, like, this is my son. You feel me? Like, why are you? feel me? Like, what? Like, you could come. Christian can come get the baby whenever. There should never be a domestic dispute with me and her friend over the baby. So then when right. y'all got there... What happened? Did, did the fade happen? No. So what happened was Marsh attacked me <laughs> while I'm holding the baby. So the fucking car, the driver nigga just drove off on me. Now I'm at the front gate. And then I guess, I don't know if, if Rock told her to stall, but she stalled and then Rock just pulled up. And then you want to know the funny part? I want to know all the parts. The funny part is me and Rock jumped in her car and left her friend right there in the middle of the street. But who's Marsh? Friends, Marsh? And Jay. Okay, Let's so then so then did Marsh end up getting beat up? No, Marsh was not harmed at all. So why are they saying Marsh got beat up? Because that's what I keep seeing online everybody uh, saying Marsh I, got beat up. Probably what I posted, because I posted like bro, I got this baby in my hand, you know, like really like getting aggressive with me, like, you know? Like she in the front seat turning around like she's gonna jump in the back seat and I'm looking like yo. Please stop. Like, I don't know. It could have just been so simple. She could have just let me leave, come here. Christian would have came here. Probably. Okay, so let me get to the end of the story. So Rock pull up. We pull off, leave her friends right there in the middle of the street. And she's like, I want to go inside and meet her. Right, let's get to the point. Like, I want to meet Jaden. I'm tired of this girl. So like, let's, like, let's get to it. I'm like, what? Are you sure? Are you serious? Like, at first, I wasn't really fucking with it, but she just sounded convincing, like she was being mature about it. So I'm like, all right, fuck it. Come on. We come inside. You know, it's, it's awkward at first, but like, they cool though. It's not like instant animosity. It's not like we're gonna wire rumble. It's kind of like, oh, okay, what's going on? Like, is it cool? Cool, what's up with the, what, 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 what? So they get cool, right? I'm playing mediator. Cool. We get, Everybody get cool. So we all come in. When, when Rock come in the house, we all get cool. The baby here. We all cool. Wait, wait. When you say all all cool, Jaden, you, Krishan, the baby, everything is calm. Everything is calm. Everything is cool. We we drinking. We all drinking together at this point. Exactly. That's my point. Like your March did all this miscellaneous shit when it when she should have just like stood down. You feel me? Like like I'm not gonna go against somebody. But you're but you're you're, you're the king of going live. Because this is your circus that you created for all of us to be a part of. Why exactly. didn't you go live when everybody was drinking and hanging out and having a good time? Um, I wasn't. My, I wasn't going for that. I really wanted. I wanted. I really wanted us to reconcile inside before we presented it outside. So, I wasn't really too focused on the the, the internet part when it was here. But this is where it went wrong. At this is where it went wrong. At so. Have you guys noticed that Krishan is in the live? She has been fact checking what Blueface has been saying. Like I said, all three of us is here, but everything's kind of on the internet. So Rock's sister is kind of like, she just pull up like, you know, we don't know if you need help. You good? You know, nobody expected Jaden and, and Krishan to be cool in the same room. So her sister pull up. When her sister pull up, she takes the baby. Right? The mom is I'm like, well, why the fuck would she take the baby? I don't, like, you know, this is not a moment for how we focused on getting the baby back so we can be back to the coolness. So, boom. Now it's like, okay, let's go get the baby. This one, it got fucked up, bro. I'm like, all right, Rock, I'm going to take you to get the baby. Jaden is like, oh, what you going to do? Fuck her on the way? Like, you, you just trying to get a nut off on, on the way. I want to take her. What do you want? I'm like, okay. And then Rock like, yeah, I want to go with her anyway. So I'm like, all right, shit. 
Cool, I'm gonna be the bigger man in this point and let y'all go get the baby and come back. Right? These these bitches go to Slauson to Boston, they out drinking, they on live before me without the fucking without the fucking head of the circus, Jason. These bitches is on live trying to kick me out the group. I'm calling I'm blowing up her phone like yo. Why would y'all I thought y'all was bringing the baby back? They like fuck you nigga pretty much. Like we out. So I'm like Okay, you're just leaving me here with the kids. Like. But here's where here's where I'm confused. This is where I'm really confused because I, I saw Jaden's live. I mean, I saw Krishan's live. Yeah, and you I was, I was together I, just having no, a good no, time. No, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on. I saw the, I saw Krishan's live when I was in the bank, right. and I thought I saw Jaden walk by, it and I was like, there ain't no way. Right. There's just no there's no way that they're together because in the interview that we had without me. No, but I mean, the interview I had with you and Jaden, she was clear, like, she didn't want nothing to do with her. No, that, and then the interview I had with Krishan, she wanted nothing to do with her. But then I'm confused at how- Jason, listen, listen, once we, once I brought them in the house, once I brought Rock and the baby in the house, like, at first, of course, it was a little tension, but, like, I don't know how. We just, everybody kind of just got over the, the separation from, like, you know, just, you know, just the separation from the kids and everything. So, once they came in- they surprised me. I'm fake, like, hold on, like, y'all not gonna try to sneak each other or nothing, right? They're like, no, we cool. They hugging and shit. I'm like, oh, fuck, all right. That's cool, I guess. We taking shots now uh, of, you know, apple juice, cranberry. We taking, I'm like, all right, cool. Fuck it. Everything is cool. They damn near ready to to live here, Jason. Rock is did like, yeah, I'm ready, I'm ready to stay. I'm ready to stay. Look, music. But did you think that was actually gonna work out? Fuck no. I did, that was uh, never gonna work. That was not. No hell no. That was not the plan. But she was just like I don't know. It just got cool fast. And then once they left and they did their thing, I don't know. I kind of feel like they just kind of felt each other out. It was almost like they just wanted to get information to see how I was moving with both of them instead of trying to like really like fuck with each other and make it all a, a cool thing. So that's where it went bad. At. It went bad when they left and just started getting drunk and going live. Cause like I said, they supposed to go get the baby and come back. Cool. I think Wack is in the room. He's texting me, I think he's in the room. But let me ask you, when after the show, when Jaden, cause Jaden, I mean, that was my first time meeting her. She was talking about how she was holding you down, waiting for you, saving her, making sure like, you know, being solid. I'm surprised that in just that moment, it's that almost she like just, she's a different, she's bro, like that's a different what I, person. That, that, so that's where, that's where I really got like, turned off and I kind of was like okay you're not really you probably not gonna be my wife if you got a ring and you just gonna leave with rock and like not answer the phone and record my phone you like you're doing the shit that that rock does you get me but do you think she's been waiting to play you though like was this something you think she's been plotting because that's um, I mean you can't I don't how think you just turn like that okay I think what do I think I think that I think I think that Jaden doesn't really like me like she loves me, of course, but I don't think she likes me. So it's like we've been we've been dealing with each other this entire time, and it's almost like, look, I'm gonna keep it real with you, Jason. I fuck with you. I proposed to Jaden to make her happy. I knew that would make her happy. So my whole objective with with all this stuff, as far as Jaden, was not to make Rock mad, but it was to make Jaden happy, right? So after I get done doing all this, and I see that she's still not happy, now I'm unhappy. That makes sense. Yeah. Like I'm, I just went, got this game, got on one knee. I'm letting it be known. I'm not doing no. You feel me? So once I do all of this, and you still like are not, like you still acting like you don't like me for real, then obviously I'm gonna be like, all right. Well, I guess you you just you know I don't know what you think about something like that. I I personally see I see you for you, and then I see you with all the bullshit. I see you. You're a really good person. Yeah. And I, cause, cause, and I know people watching are, oh, you just saying that. You, no, I mean, I really feel like one, I know that you, you put everybody in position to get money. Yeah. Everybody that we, everybody that we talk Bro, about every day online. You want to know the, you want to know the narrative? Hey, can I, I finish telling, can I finish no, no, telling no, you fuck, fuck you, this is my story. <laughs> I'm not in the circus. The, you want to know the yes, you is? No, I'm not. You, 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 no, I'm not. <laughs> you need to sponsor the fucking circus as much as you be fucking. Yo, I'm telling, I'm telling you right you now. I, t- I told Lemmy the other day, this needs to be crazy in love too. T O O, because this right here should be making you all money. You right, not entertaining. You right, you right, uh, you chill. 
I'm not gonna let you. You're you're you're, you're you're too you're too brilliant to be giving this bag away for free. Not for sure. I mean, it, it, it's beneficial, but fuck all that. Like I don't know. I care for the, the beneficial part, but that's what I was saying. The narrative that I hate about all of this is that I'm helping these women to help myself. Well, I think you said on the show that that Krishan to you was an investment and that this whole situation seems like a big investment on your behalf. I mean, right. and I'm not taking sides. I'm just saying what you said. And ultimately, everybody has benefited, including Carlissa. Right. You know, um, so I, I, I feel like, so you know, how, your mind's how am I harboring these people to make it seem like I'm doing well, this? To- well, I will say it seems like you've you've invested so much in people and it almost seems like at any given moment everybody turns on you i don't know i'm not taking sides on why that happens thank you thank you no no, but i'm not taking sides on why that happens but i just feel like you put everybody in a position to to do whatever you want to do but at the other The other hand, I think everybody also wants to be happy. I don't know what happiness is for you. I would ask you, like, what is happiness for you? Because it seems like happiness for everybody keeps changing every day. Literally, shit. Uh, happiness for me? What? I... <sighs> I don't even know. Bro. Because I, because I don't because I'm telling you right now, we're gonna hang up. I'm gonna get on a flight. I'm gonna land in Miami. I'm gonna go live, and Krishan or somebody or Jaden's gonna be at your house, or you're gonna be over at the studio. I mean, like, it's no, like no, this is right not now. Honestly, right now, look. Look, so look, all right, let me let me get to the story. All right, so boom, after they they left, I felt betrayed. I felt like they teamed up because they came back with like this this energy was that that was like, you know, you just know. So that's so once I seen that, I was honestly kind of like, I'm like, just fuck both of them at this point. It's like, I, it's not even something to choose. You get me? Yeah. It's like, I might as well just start over and, and be by myself. I don't think that's possible though. More you, you have to be by myself. No, yeah, absolutely not. When you're by yourself, I think that's when your mind starts working, and then that's when we have the lives and the tweets, and the, the, then here we I mean, are. I can, I can live. Oh, you feel me? I can. That's what I'm saying. I, I think I should live by myself. Okay, but you have two kids by one and one kid by another, so you're going to have to interact with them in some capacity. Yeah, no, of course, of course, we all interact. I'm still, you know, do my part, do the holiday thing. You know, that's my thing. But I don't got to live with them. They don't got to live with me as long as they in another. So it looks like they got disconnected, but I want you guys to tell me in the comments section, what would you have wanted Jason Lee to ask Blueface? What questions would you have asked? Let me know in the comments. Hey, Blue. Hey. I feel like what? I'm a working mom. I just watch y'all and I love y'all. And oh, I, I respect you and your whole situation. Everybody got their own private shit going on. Right. And you just keep on what you're doing. Type shit. Appreciate it. So who's the problematic in this? Um, to be honest, all three of y'all. Because everybody got their own way of thinking. So you'll never really understand how Krishan and Jaden feel. They don't really never understand you or Krishan. You know what I'm saying? So all three of y'all the problem. And that's right. why all three of y'all got to deal with it your own way. But who do you... Who do you, I don't know if it's a thing of love, but, or, is there a, a option between Jay and Krishan? Yeah, honestly, I'm about to, I'm about to, uh, I'm about to revamp, man, I'm about to try something else. I'm, um, I, I don't want to make it an option, I feel like that's the, yeah. that's the tricky part, it's, it's better to just not even fuck around with nah. it. Right? I feel you, yeah, you, you right about that, you just live for yourself, sometimes you gotta be selfish, and that's for all three of y'all. But I'm, I'm for all of y'all. And I'm no. proud of all three of y'all. So you just keep doing what you're doing. Appreciate you. Yeah, no problem. I think I'm the problem, cuz. Hey, y'all messy. I didn't say I can't pick, bro. That's not what I said. <laughs> didn't say that at all. I said that it's not worth it. It's not worth choosing at this point because I don't know. I don't feel like either of them fuck with me for real, so it's like, I don't know. Shit. They fuck with me, but I'm a different type of, type of nigga to fuck with. So I don't feel like they fuck with me, but whatever. Said I can have both of them.
<sighs> Not into that, really. It's hard to keep one bitch happy. I don't, I don't think I can keep two bitches happy. Shit, I can barely keep one bitch happy. Right now. He said he can't keep one or two girls happy, but yet he has all these other side girls. I don't understand. Somebody explain that to me. Good. Serious business. Or I'm at that. All right, fuck it. Y'all tell me who to choose, Kay. Because y'all want to be messy. Y'all want to be messy. Y'all spam who y'all want me to choose. Okay. It's like fake 50 50 though. That's cool. I like that. I like that it's 50 50. And then, yeah, some it's some of those choose yourselves. That's right. I'm going to choose myself. Thank y'all. Y'all so nice. I'm choosing me. That's who I'm choosing. I'm back on the prowl. And I'm looking for a nice little owl. <laughs> you did it. Looking for a nice little bird to come save me. I said take it slow. I know I should take it slow. Take it slow. Add my mom. Oh, I can't. I can't. I'm sorry, guys. I don't. I don't even talk to her. So I can I don't even want to talk to her on here. I don't talk to her in real life. Like at all. No conversation, no text, no phone call, no nothing. Definitely adding Carlissa. Jason. What's up, Jason, bro? What's up, man? I'm gonna need some compensation for you uh, taking over the circus. Ah, but I'm here for it. Why y'all keep tagging Carlissa, bro? Ugh, my mom is getting famous. It's so annoying. I really commented to tag her. Her evil plans are working. Somebody said do a house tour. No, I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna show you how it looks right now. I don't give a fuck. Welcome to the circus. To the front. It's people's clothes outside. Then we got this. Burritos and shit. I don't know. They just had like a, a break shit a thon. Like. So that's just how it went. Rock started breaking shit. And then Jaden started breaking shit. And I don't know. I didn't even really care to fight. Like, I ain't finna. I'm, I'll just let them break the shit. Like, all right, get your little anger out there. Look. Look how they got a nigga stove. No more apple pies. No apple pie tonight. God oh, damn. There you go. Fucked up a nigga little fuck shway. 
Feng Shui fucked over. Fucked up the studio, of course. But she's crazy. Just worked on this shit. <sighs> yep, I'm in here hungry for sure. Yeah, I'm starving actually. Actually, I'm very hungry. This was, they just start throwing the bottles at the damn bar. That's how, that's how like, I don't know if they was just drunk, but it's like they was just doing dumb shit, like throwing the bottle at the wall. Like, shit is crazy. And then Rock, I don't know who the fuck told Rock she was strong. Her weird ass. I'm gonna try to lift up this piano and flip the piano. But she got mad and just broke the top off. And she went like this, like, I'm gonna flip it. And then she just said, fuck it, and just broke that. Some weirdo shit. Keep going along on the tour. That's what you guys wanna see, right? See, that's the problem right here. He drunk all that damn henny. Hey, well, they ain't break nothing in there, at least. Welcome to the Blue Circus. No kids. Okay. The laundry room is decent though. Kurt. Shout out to Jaden. You, you kept the laundry room decent, baby. Oh. It's cool in here. Not too bad up in here. We good. The upstairs is straight. Look, guys. Down, yeah. Oh, she done left the crib. It's all good, though. It's all good. Yeah, who wanna come? Who gonna come clean this shit up, though? Is that all right? Hey, hey, at least I got my dog, man. Ain't that right? At least I got my dog, right? Roof, roof. That's right. At least I got my dog. Fuck them hoes, girl. All the cleaning service. All right, send me the number. Send me the number. Oh, you know, you know how I might have, how I need to have clean up. I know I need to have cleaned up for real. I'm gonna, have, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna have little Mabu come clean it up. I'm gonna get that butt, Mabu. Think I'm playing. I'm gonna get that butt. I didn't help. I didn't help you get. You feel me? I didn't help you, bro. You owe me some ass, man. Sorry. That's the rules to milk music. You signed up. You signed up, Mabu. Now I gotta get that butt. Shit. You wanna know why Mabu owe me some butt? Cause let me tell y'all why. If you go and look at their little music video, 
my concert tickets is being sold under their music video. You know what that means, Matt Booth? That means you have you you put a lot of blue face in, in them in the descriptions. You put so much blue face in the description, my brother, that you selling my concert tickets on your video. Thank you. I appreciate that. That's why I said you signed for this music because I know what you did. I know what you did. I'm going to get that butt. Now, we could do this the easy way or we could do this the hard way. I'm going to get that butt. <laughs> <laughs> Don't ask why. Mm -hmm. Yeah, man. I'm going to get that butt. You paying me to sell them? Nah, shut the hell up. You know what you did to get my concert tickets in that in that video? You put you damn near put me as a feature on that motherfucker. Cause that don't even make sense. Everybody go look at that music video and tell me why I say blue face concert Santa Ana tickets in the goddamn description. I'm crip. So you signed to MILF Music, my boo. I own you. And you gonna give me some of that butt. One, one way or another, man. <laughs> I know I fuck around, man. I'm proud of you, though, son. You made something of yourself. Making most music look good. I'm just fucking around, y'all. Nobody wants that little mayonnaise butt. <laughs> Nobody wants that little mayonnaise butt, dude. Just fucking with you, little bro. Happy for you. I ain't gonna touch that little man in his butt. It's all I'm concerned. All right, so that's the end of the Instagram Live. So what do you guys think about Jane Alexis leaving Blueface? Do you think this is do you think this is temporary? Do you think this is temporary? Do you think it's permanent? What do you guys feel about that? And what do you think of his <laughs> Very spiraling Instagram live. Let me know your thoughts. Thank you so very much for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And if you have any hot tea for me, message me on Instagram. I love you guys. Bye.